fighting this communication. Sometimes you just on save wave. Uh huh. All right, here we go. ZSS Bayonetta versus Zelda and Gloria. Very interesting team comes here, but here we go. Yeah, I, I've seen Shu play doubles. I'm a big fan of Shu in doubles. Yeah. Yeah, like. Oh my goodness, their movement is so insane. And also just being able to play, like, this character is hard in doubles. Your hitboxes are kind of, like, kind of precise. They're very you know? unique, for sure. <laughs> but, I mean, one of the biggest things that uh, ZSS has here in doubles, at least from my experience, is that grab, right? I mean, you, it's just, like, in, in normal singles, right, that grab is probably not the best in the world, but in doubles, it's going to catch a lot of people off guard, and you're going to get a lot of value off of too. So. Yeah, yeah. You can guard here. Bayo, also one of the characters that was highly regarded in Smash 4, too. Kind of towards the end of the, the meta, right? Double Bayo was probably going to be, like, the meta team, or, or Bayo Cloud at some point. Yeah. Uh, didn't come to fruition. Luckily, uh, we had Smash Ultimate to come by, right? Yeah, save, yeah. save us from Bayo. But we still have so many good Bayos around. Oh, right? yeah, for sure. I mean, Jazzy Z showed us that it's not too bad. Able to make it back and get a lot of that, like, air mobility and air pressure that Bayonetta is really known for. Yeah, so. and that's the nicest part about teaming with Bayo, right? Is, like, you do not have... That character's not a liability. Oh, for sure. Once they're off stage, it's like, all right, you're going to you're make, gonna it back. make it back. Yeah, <laughs> you're going to make it back. If they yeah. never Ooh. are panicky, but... The <laughs> lightning kick from Purple Kai. Let's go. Yeah, right at shield, too. So there's nothing you can do about that situation. My goodness, I can't believe. <laughs> They're still close. Dude, okay, Zelda down air is not good. It's so funny to see how often they still go for down oh, air. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if it works, it works. Yeah, true, 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 true. <laughs> it's just Especially a double is very low risk as well, but... Yeah. Not gonna actually confirm it the Zelda down here just like oh you said. Oh my goodness. When it works, it Look, works, baby. Well, how can I <laughs> I'm sorry for lying to you, chat. I'm sorry. It's just sometimes there's the soft hit and you're oh, like, no, why? Yeah, it's bad, yeah. Like why does it, why does this exist? There's so many dead zones in Zelda already. We don't need more. Nice, okay. Shu really trying something a little spicy right there. A little extended combo with Bayonetta off stage. Okay. Still the bike though, not able to hit. Ooh. Trying to get the up smash, but not gonna we whip with the lightning kick again. Goodness. Another stock for uh, here. Yeah, that, man, that's the crazy part about Zelda is that much, that much killing power, right? Uh -huh. And that's one of the good attributes to have as a character when you are playing doubles is having an aerial that will, will kill. Unfortunately for Zelda, you have to be just like just like Zero Suit, precise with it. But when it hits, man, it hits. It hits hard. It's like a truck. But right now, nice looking for Red Team because we're just getting a lot of juggles, a lot of these edge guards. Good advantage stay here for Shu, trying to hit that down smash, but Purple Guy oh. F-smashing his teammate. Oh, God. Yeah, Jazzy G not ready for that situation, but still controlling the center of the stage. They are not finding their way back to the center. Oh, uh, my God. Jazzy G with a stock, an incredible ladder combo. Yeah, oh, is that going to get a grab for a little bit of punish? But no wops is going to connect there for Eliza. Yeah, that's... We, we've been talking about all the characters, but we haven't been really talking about Wario too yeah, that's much. The thing. We already, I mean, you guys are already familiar with the character. Off. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this character is just insane in doubles. How, like, also, mobility is huge in doubles. We see it with the way that Shu is playing. We see it with the way that Jazz G is playing. Like, being able to weave in and out and still uh, create pressure is very important. And Wario is literally the personification of, like, weaving in and out, right? Oh, wow, Jazz G oh, with the confirmed. That yep. was insane. Yeah, that's the little bit of cheese that wow. we're talking about, right? The bail combo into the flip kick in the back is going to see on the first game. Jazzy G and Shu showing that coordination, right? Yeah, that's what yeah. you need in double. Uh -huh. that, someone's got the meat sauce, someone's got the spaghetti, and now <laughs> they just put it together, you put some beautiful, cheese on it. That's a beautiful dish, right? Yeah, there, there it is. Dish. So good. That's I, a homemade classic. I know, we we seen it. You see them attempt it earlier, and it didn't work. I'm so glad we actually got to see it, like, mm -hmm. work this time. And yeah, it looked really good. Yeah, and in tandem with having their partner on stage. Mm -hmm. Because, like, when you're that far away off stage, and your partner's <laughs> in the center of the stage, and they're like, I have to get to them. Yeah, how but, am I going to get <laughs> How am I gonna help them? How are you going to do that? Yeah, like, no, it's tough. Yeah, you, you have to play a character that can, like, interrupt stuff like that from that far away. Like, something like a... Let's say Thoron from Robin, oh, right? Yeah. Or or maybe even uh, I was saying Rob if it, Laser, if it right? was uh, if it was um, Elizak that was getting combo, not Purple Guy. I think Purple Guy could have maybe done Din's Flare, right? I mean, just yeah, throw out the side just 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 so, just something to interrupt something, yeah. right? Like it doesn't matter who you interrupt right there because if you stop one of them, you probably would have been able, been able to save your partner, right? You still have <laughs> to follow up and catch the rebound, right? Bring your boy back for sure. Right, but not going into game two, we're going to have to see a different strategy here coming from Purple Guy and Elizak because what we saw was a little uncoordinated, right? I mean, mainly relying on Purple Guy's kill power to take those stocks, Man, right? that was kill power. 
So I those mean, heals. Elizak not able to get too many stocks there, not too much damage. I feel like uh, the Waft was trying to come and make a little bit of a comeback, but you know, we're completely. So yeah. we'll see what happens here in this game too. I think they have enough pressure to the point where they should be just grabbing a lot more. Mm -hmm. But against these two characters, like kind of hard to grab. Kind of <laughs> hard. And, and a little hard to grab ZSS. Yeah, yeah. And <laughs> we we were having a little bit of discussion right before we came onto the mic about yeah. talking about doubles, where like shielding is layer one of the meta, right? Like when you get into doubles and you figure out that shielding is busted in doubles, like shielding, you don't want to shield normally in Smash Brothers, but in doubles, like people will try to layer as much as they can. And if you just hold shield and get that punish, you can get so much mileage out of it, right? But, but I mean, these two characters are definitely layer two, right? Yeah. Where you're just staying in the air and trying to avoid any interactions there. But just getting those confirms, man, that in those ladders, Ridiculous stuff from Jaggy. Right? I mean, yeah. we saw some crazy stomp combos. So that's just, oh gosh, it's so hard if you play a character that just does not jump high enough, right? <laughs> you're playing against a bayonetta. <laughs> your, your teammates getting combos. Like, oh, save me! And I'm like, if I jump up here, I will kill I'm you. I'm gonna die too. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or, like, or I will die I'm too. Get that's true. Oh, oh. the shoe confirmed with the flip kick. Insane stuff to take the first stomp no already. No hesitation too, right? Like immediately, it's. Hate confirms in this game are relatively like easy compared to other fighting games, but still, like just being like you have to react to uh, oh, DI yeah. and it's Especially not easy. It doubles. It, I mean, yeah. you have to be aware of so much and still be able to hit that confirm. Yeah. Like that's pretty tight. So uh -huh. I respect it. Nice, very good awareness right here from Chu. Oh, oh no! Get up there from yeah. Purple, I got his teammate again. I like the attempt, but this is doubles. That yeah. armor, like that throw armor, is ridiculous. Hold. So oh. good. I mean, are you kidding me? This what are they doing? Stuff. Look at the coordination. I mean, even just the positioning. Right? This is not training mode, guys. <laughs> These are real people. This is a real match, guys. You have to focus up. Yeah, yeah. It's <laughs> crazy. True, true. Yeah, I, I do want to see like way more grabs or just more buttons being pushed by Eliza, right? Like yeah. just really get them on their toes, get them to shield, or get them not to jump anymore because it's important. I mean, look at Chewie. I mean, he's doing such a good job right now. Just making sure to play safe, really take time. Oh, no. I mean, so much damage. Yeah. Eliza's just been in disadvantage for what feels like nearly the first, the whole first game, and now oh even more God, in this is game. Oh, my God. Is F-Smash trying to catch Purple Guy? This is the early shot. We're not going to do it. The uppy finally allows Purple Guy to get a little bit of stake control. But that oh. downwards AP. Oh, Oh, no. God. That's going to be a ladder. That oh, is so <laughs> high up there. Yo, this team pop is insane. Oh, this is not fair. Oh, Yo, no how, way. Oh, how my God. That would have been nasty. Why was he in position for that? What the <laughs> How do you know it go that far away? The coordination they, on this team is insane. They must play each other's characters. Oh, yeah. For sure. For sure. I mean, this is the thing with these two characters. They're pretty similar, right, in their play style. I, I mean, you see a lot of Bayonetta players probably try out ZSS. Yeah, yeah maybe. <laughs> Vice versa. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe the back air. Like, I, I don't know. I, I just don't see, like, the... I just don't see it. It's just like the, the, the play style, right? Just getting those confirms and then just in and out and then being that quick, right? I mean, they're very uh, yeah, 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 yeah. So. Yeah, true, true, true. They can get to places in time, right? Uh, with Bayonetta, that mobility, nice. It does not even need to spike right there, too. Not even close. I mean, that's insane stuff. Oh. You just get so much value off this flip game. Yeah, actually, so much pressure being displayed right here, too. Neither of these players on blue team actually can find any footing, and it feels like most of the mileage gotten was just off of pure reversal. Right there. Yeah, and another confirm oh. off of No, it's killed. I can't believe that kid. I thought he was going to live. Oh, uh, trying to save him. Insane. Oh, rude. <laughs> so that smash was definitely rude. I mean, now Elizak stuck in this 1v2 situation on this last stock here in oh. game two. Okay. Seems... So panicked actually right now, and you you kind of have to have a little bit more discipline when it comes to yeah. these two v one situations. We saw with the way that Jeja was playing those two v ones against Twan and Moonboy Josh. I, I kind of want to see a little bit more uh, discipline displayed right here from Eliza. Oh man, I mean, Shu and Jazzy G's position in this game was oh, insane. No. Like they're, oh, they're just... I cannot believe it. I mean, right now we're seeing. Eliza trying to make a little bit of a comeback. The bike gonna set him off stage, and he actually to take the first okay. stock of yeah. Jazzy G. You guys need to chill and just end it, right? Here. Yeah. I mean, that looks like it's gonna be a confirm right now. Oh, oh my! No. All the way down. <laughs> I thought that was setting out. That was insane. That was insane. Stepped on him. <laughs> wow. Yeah, Jazzy G and Sue can take that very convincingly. Very convincingly. They were, that was. You. You know they were looking for it. Oh, I mean, come on. But I mean, still, like, that's not easy to hit, right? Like, that's True. pretty impressive. True. Yeah, it, it, it's oh, kind of crazy with these characters that have to jump so damn high, yeah. right? And some characters 
they get to the high, like they get to the air so quick. Like unless you have a character like that, you're probably not gonna work well with that. I, I want the beginning of that combo to like get the first hit and then pause and be like, which blast zone do you think is gonna go? <laughs> How do you think this combo? Imagine is if end? it spiked all the way to the right. Yeah, like, right. Like, <laughs> died on the left for some reason. Yeah, I yeah. That could have ended in any blast zone. Oh yeah. For, for sure. Yeah, yeah. It could have just like it kind of down. Up, it kind of shut down. Yeah, and it goes yeah. to the left, and mm -hmm. it could have killed to the right. When you honest, when you start know. mixing knockback angles, you get some very interesting stuff oh, yeah. in this video game. For sure, it's really funny. It's so, dude. It, okay, I don't know how often you play for, uh, like free for all with items, 